In this section, I'm going to teach you how to add light boxes in and also how to add hyperlinks in. Now, hyperlinks are basically either images or words that you click on and it will bring you to another website or a page within your site or even anchor text. So, I'll show you how to do hyperlinks. Light boxes are an ability so that if you do a hyperlink to another website, it doesn't take you off of your website keeps you right on your website, but it opens up, up into another separate page. It's better for me to show you than to tell you. So let's take a look. First things first, we're going to add a picture. So there's an image box already set up here. I'm simply going to go into my link and I'll just choose this car for the time being. You can choose any file you wish. And again, I can adjust the image, left or right. I can rotate it left or right if I want to. I can zoom into the picture or zoom out of the picture. So now that I have this picture, I want to hyperlink it. Because maybe what I want to do if I'm an artist is I want to have the picture show bigger. In order to do that, I'll click hyperlink. And I can choose picture. Now this is where the light box comes in. It says same window or a light box, and I want it to be a light box. Under my light box options, I can put text in here. And then hit OK. So when I go to preview that picture, and I click on the picture, it shows the picture and it shows my caption. This is my new set of wheels. Now, I hear you already, you're saying, what if I want the caption on the top? That's easy to do. Let me show you how to do it. You go under File, Site Properties, and Lightbox. And this will give you all sorts of options that you can do. And the thing that we want is we want to show our caption on the top is what we said. So here it says caption bottom and I just choose caption top and click OK. And when I preview it now, it'll show my caption on the top. See. Now let's take it one step further. What if I want to hyperlink that into a website? Okay. This time I would choose internet page and I'll just choose that clicks. And this time under my lightbox options it asks me how big I want the website to show. I'm going to put in 800 by 1000 pixels because I know that my website itself is a thousand pixels wide. I don't want it to consume the entire website, but I do want it to show nicely. So here's how that looks. I hit File, Preview, Preview Page in Google Chrome, or Mozilla, or Explorer, whichever browser you prefer is fine. I click on the car, and this time it's going to show my Got Click site. And there's scroll bars here so that I can scroll back and forth. So I'm still on my website, but I'm not being taken away from my main website page. So that's how light boxes work, and that's hyperlinking a picture. What if I want to hyperlink text? It's very simple. I just highlight the text, I right click. I click hyperlink and I'll take it to an internet page now if I hit same window it would take me away from my website I'm going to do lightbox again choose lightbox options I don't have any text in here and I'm going to choose so you can see the difference 1000 by 800 let's see what that looks like click OK I'll click Highlight, Preview Site, Preview Page in Google Chrome.
And when I click on the hyperlink, it opens up into my free online tutorials, the .hyphenclicks.com site. Okay? So that is how you do hyperlinks, that's how you do uh, light boxes, and that's how you hyperlink to photographs. I hope this is helpful for you, and thanks so much for tuning in to Got Clicks channel on YouTube. And also, make sure that you sign up for our free online tutorials that will teach you how to use internet marketing tactics such as Facebook, YouTube, and others with got-clicks.com. I'm Sarah Spencer, the founder of Got Clicks, and thank you so much for watching.